Unfortunately, it is well documented that the current state of education in Indiana is poor. Many of us would give it a D plus at that. We have dedicated teachers who every day try to do the best jobs that they can, but we're in essence tying one hand behind the back by not providing them with the salaries that they need in order to get the job done. Because our salaries are so low compared to other states, we're losing teachers to Illinois, to Michigan, to Ohio, and to Kentucky. And then we have teachers that are leaving the profession altogether. Education is our number one priority in the state. Number one, we have to pay our teachers more. We have to support our teachers professionally, not by mandating that they take this class or that class, but by giving them many more opportunities to gain new skills as they need them. And we've got to stop testing everyone to death on in the, in the state of Indiana. The, the I-STEP test was a failure. The I-LEARN test has been a failure. And we're not even using the results as a state uh, in order to make decisions. I'm not against testing. I'm against testing that doesn't work. I'm against testing when it dominates the teacher's agenda every single day. That's not the kind of testing we need. We need a different approach to testing in Indiana, and that's what we'll have if and when I'm elected governor. We're not putting our funds towards the districts that need help the most. The rich districts get richer, and the poor districts get poorer. In my administration, making certain that the resources are available for our kids to learn K through 12 in every school district will be the priority. With respect to traditional public schools and charter schools, I think we need to level the playing field. Uh, I believe that there can be much more collaboration. I've suggested we put a moratorium on new charters until we are better prepared to deal with the many issues that have been created. In the old days, uh, we thought that perhaps every kid ought to get prepared to go to college. Now we know that not every child should go to college. So I'm very much for an aggressive um, a movement towards more options in high school for our kids to explore different careers, whether it's a trade, uh, whether it's a, a, a career uh, related to a technology, get them better prepared for the jobs of today and not make the assumptions of yesterday. I'm an IPS Indianapolis Public School graduate. I am a proud Short Ridge High School Blue Devil. I just know we can do better. That's why I'm running. I want Indiana to achieve its full potential. Indiana for far too long has been a state where we thought it was good enough. Well, good enough is just no longer good enough for the state of Indiana. We have to excel. And that's what I want to do here in Indiana. Put us in a position to win. I put people first, not politics. I'm running because Hoosiers deserve better than good enough. So join me to fight for Indiana's future.